What's going on, y'all? Master Teacher of Attraction back with another video, and in this one, I wanted to talk about the um the diet that I stay on to stay healthy, all right, attractive, and uh, athletic. Okay, you know I'm able to you know actually move out here, all right, and this is the diet that I do, all right. It's called the listen to your body diet all right it's really simple you just listen to your damn body all right you don't do nothing anybody else on on the outside tell you what to do all right so if my body is saying that it needs some damn carbs all right i'm gonna pick out some carb sources that i know that my body does well with all right if my body feels like it's starting to you know dry up i'm not you know it's i'm you know i'm lacking oil and all that in my skin my skin getting dry my lips is chapped all right i mean i need to get a little bit of fat up in my diet all right i'm gonna probably go after some type of you know dairy or something that i can handle all right and just one thing with dairy some people can do it some people can't but understand like with my experience if i go away from dairy for a long time i have to wean myself back on the dairy all right, so I have to go through a period of where, you know, my digestive system is, you know, you know, getting building the the um the digestive system up to be able to, you know, uptake the nutrients out of dairy. All right? Cuz when I was young, I had no issues with dairy. Just eating yogurt and cheese and uh milk all the time. All right, no issues. And then I started doing the, um, get into working out and resistance training. I left that stuff alone because everybody talking about you got to leave dairy alone. So I left that stuff alone for years. And then when I tried to go back to dairy, that's when my body was like, ah, oh, we can't do that shit. So, you know, if you ever going through something like that, but, you know, dairy has a lot of nutrition in it. Um, so I just wanted to get that perspective on that. But, you know. If my body wants some damn potatoes, I know I can't go and um, eat, you know, an unfully cooked potato, all right? But my body can digest for some reason, all right? And this is healthy for me. It may not work for everybody else. They be saying they get fat on it, but french fries, okay? It's a potato, and it's cooked all the way through. It's very easy to digest for me since, it's you know, it's cooked all the way through. All right, and that works for me. All right, other people say that's not healthy, but for me, it works. Okay, um, and then protein, man. If I feel that I'm not, you know, getting some good ass sleep, my blood sugar kind of all over the place, you know, my my muscle and everything starting to lack, starting to lose hair and everything, um, all that bad stuff, then I'm gonna get some damn protein. All right. I'm going to want it, especially if I'm craving some damn fish, if I'm craving a steak. All right? If I don't want no damn burger, I'm not finna go get no burger. All right? If I don't want no, you know, raisin bran, I don't give a damn who said that shit is healthy. All right? I only eat when my body was complementary to my digestive system and that promotes life inside of my body. Okay? And that's why these women be walking up in the grocery store trying to spit game at your boy. All right, that's cause you know they 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 feel in the energy. When you eat food, that's energy. Okay, at the end of the day, food is energy. So you gotta put that good energy inside of your body so it can show up from the inside out. All right, that's what it's about. All right, so I don't do no uh, none of these stupid you know diets. And I'm gonna I'm gonna make a couple videos about some of them, the most popular ones out there. But I don't do none of these stupid diets, man. I don't, you know, cut my carbs out no more, all right? Because that was detrimental, all right? I don't uh do low protein or, you know, eat 500 grams of protein, all right? I just eat a pound of meat. That's what my body likes, all right? And it works for me. Y'all see I'm not out here without no, you know, out here skinny as a rail? All right, I got some muscle on me. I wouldn't be, you know, 100 over 170 pounds right now if I wasn't, cause you know, actually keeping it, you know, 
tight and everything. All right, most dudes at this height and weight, you know, they be fat with a belly hanging over, man. But that's because, you know, my nutrition on point. I listen to my body. The body knows more about nutrition than you do or Dr. Oz do or YouTube or Google knows. Okay, it knows what you're deficient in. It knows what you're lacking in. It knows what you don't need no more of. It knows all this stuff. All right? So if you feel that you need to fast, go ahead and fast. Don't be worried about, oh, my protein is not high enough for the day. If your body say that it got enough right now, then it got enough right now. If it don't want to eat, then don't, for don't force the body to eat. All right? If it's ready to eat, don't be talking about, you know, oh, I'm on my intermittent fast. I'm still within my window. Like, no, get that ego stuff out your head, man. Because if the body say that it needs something, it could be a, a, a mineral that is running running low on it could be a vitamin is running low on okay you know a macronutrient is running low on so go give the body what it want and the body is going to give you what you want all right which is your health to be attractive to women now here so you ain't got a cold approach you know random women that don't want you and listen to AMS dating advice okay on how to um on how to lie to hoes um and be, you know, athletic. Y'all know I don't like using that word, uh, you know, fit or in shape. You should be athletic out here. Y'all remember the range I showed y'all? All right? So, that's the diet I'm on. Listen to your body.